So before we start the lectures, I request uh, the ICS Director, Professor Rajesh Kopakuma, to welcome you all and also to describe the activities of ICS. Uh, thank you. Uh, and uh, yeah, warm welcome on this nice sunny morning to Bangalore. Uh, uh, so this, I believe, is the second such workshop on uh, population genetics and evolution. I'm glad that it's sort of evolving, so to say, and, uh, and hopefully it will sort of become a regular activity. Uh, I, I'll just, uh, I won't take very much of your time, I promise. I'll just give you a very quick sort of a bird's eye view of uh, ICTS, uh, the institution, what we try to do, and so on. Uh, uh, so, uh, so ICTS was actually established in 2007, and uh, what we see ourselves as is a sort of an enabling center which will take uh, scientific research in India to a sort of a next higher plane. We focus on the basic sciences, uh, yes, physics, chemistry, biology, and mathematics, computer science, uh, and allied areas. Uh, uh, so, uh, so how do we hope to sort of do, do this enabling? Well, one of its core mandates, and that's what all of you here are part of, is to have high quality visitor-driven programs and schools of varying duration, uh, and in which we uh, hope to bring together the best researchers in the country as well as from outside uh, to basically come together, uh, be at a place where you can sort of share your expertise uh, collaborate and sort of hopefully come up with new ideas. Uh, uh, so that's what uh, we hope to be. But this is tied up with our own in-house research. Uh, this is tied up with our own in-house research uh, in the sense that we have a, a small but uh, uh, a high quality uh, uh, staff on uh, who do research in various disciplines in the theoretical sciences, uh, and in a sense, their profiles are sort of similar to the to the broad uh, um, intentions of ICTS that they they have core strengths in various areas, and I'll say a little bit about the areas uh, soon. But uh, but with a sort of an intellectual openness to uh, uh, to other disciplines and. Uh, uh, and so these programs, so, uh, we hope that that will help the ICTS community as well to sort of get new ideas, to get uh, new exposure to, uh, to various things. The, uh, so there was uh, the programs, our in-house research, and the third uh, important component is outreach. And uh, so these are the three core mandates of ICTS. So we hope to, uh, we, we try to bring the excitement of scientific research uh, to the public and uh, uh, through public lectures and various other activities, partnering with organizations involved in science education, and more generally, we hope to engage with society on broader issues which need scientific input. Uh, uh, so we have on this Thursday a public lecture by uh, Professor Lata Venkatram, and it's a very fascinating topic uh, that she's going to talk about on uh, single molecule uh, going down to sort of chips uh, built from single molecules. So, uh, uh, so she's done some very pioneering work on this, and I would encourage all of you to sort of uh, 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 go for this lecture. Uh, uh, the um, uh, as for our in-house research, we have about uh, I said a small number, so about a dozen or so people, uh, and um, uh, there's a large floating population of visitors and postdoctoral fellows and graduate students. In fact, our graduate program in physics has been running for the last two, three years. And there's, in fact, a joint program with NCBS for physics students who want to do biology. Uh, and uh, this year, we are going to start something in mathematics. Uh, the, the, the broad areas uh, in which people are working right now at ICTS include astrophysical relativity, uh, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the group here is very much involved in the effort to detect gravitational waves, uh, uh, data assimilation, big data, and dynamical systems, statistical physics, condensed matter physics, uh, string theory, quantum field theory, and quantum gravity, and of course, physical biology. I mean, biology is sort of with a quantitative aspect to it, uh, uh, and uh, various interdisciplinary mathematical topics. Uh, 
we, we have been a platform for a number of new initiatives in India, uh, in particular the gravitational wave uh, project in India, LIGO India. Uh, we are sort of a nodal, nodal center for that. We have been uh, involved in the pilot phase of a large data high-speed network called India Light. Uh, there's a quantitative biology program. I don't know, maybe some of you may have come for that. Uh, uh, we, this, we just finished the fourth in that series uh, last month. Um, uh, so it alternates between ICTP in Trieste and ICTS. Uh, so we had two installments each in both places. And, uh, and, uh, uh, and people seem to be very keen to take this ahead. And I believe the next one might be on evolutionary uh, uh, the next one at ICTS two years down the uh, this, uh, road might be on evolutionary topics. Uh, but uh, uh, but any case, uh, so that's a, sort of an initiative we have been uh, uh, involved with. Uh, the Asian winter schools on string theory, summer schools in condensed matter physics, as an initiative with Brandeis on statistical physics. And we were one of the main, uh, uh, the key people in this Mathematics of Planet Earth initiative of 2013. Uh, so uh, about ICTS programs, I just want to say a couple of words about them. So uh, our, our programs, like uh, the current one, uh, typically have some components, not necessarily all of them, uh, but pedagogical lectures, which you're having uh, by experts. And the idea is to get junior researchers to sort of be able to get into a new area. Uh, and, uh, and we want a large sort of a discussion component so that uh, there are chances, as Deepa mentioned just now, for you to sort of strike up conversations and maybe collaborations uh, and generally get to, uh, get to uh, exchange ideas. Uh, and perhaps there could be a conference, but I don't think this one uh, you're having a conference, right? But, uh, uh, but there could be a conference component as well. But the first two are actually the ones we lay stress on. Uh, uh, and uh, we'd like to see these programs have this participatory involvement of students and postdocs. It's sort of primarily geared towards you folks. So, uh, um, so the idea is that you, uh, you sort of uh, talk to people, ask questions, and so on. I mean, be very interactive. Uh, I just want to reiterate that. Uh, and uh, we'd like to, of course, see programs come up with new, uh, 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 incubate new ideas, and also in the Indian context, perhaps bring, uh, bring uh, new areas of research which are not represented, perhaps, in the Indian scientific community. Uh, uh, so, uh, and in many cases, we would like it to be a forum uh, where theory and experiment can also sort of uh, meet each other. So we've had about 105 programs and 32 discussion meetings, uh, and with a large number of participants, so 5,000 uh, plus, uh, and a substantial number from abroad. Uh, so it's, I, I think, had a tangible impact on the Indian scene, and we hope with our new campus, uh, uh, we, will, uh, we will sort of be able to take this ahead. This is a sampling of the sort of variety of the programs we've had, from random matrix theory, monsoon workshop on string theory, uh, cosmology, a role of theory in biology, meteorology, and even uh, a couple of a month or so ago on the macroeconomics of finance, which again I think was sort of co-organized by someone who uh, who was at the Center for Ecological Studies in IAC, uh, um, who brought in I think uh, some of the expertise from uh, 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 from uh, from that. Sort of a discipline, uh, so uh, so it's a wide variety, and uh, we we welcome that, and we sort of like to have that. Uh, we also have, in addition, uh, certain named lecture series. Uh, uh, the three primary ones are after Chandrasekhar, Ramanujan, and Turing. Uh, the Subramaniam Chandrasekhar one is in the physical sciences, and we've had a long list of very eminent speakers there. Uh, Ramanujan is on mathematics, both pure and applied. And again, uh, 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 we have a, uh, we, uh, we've had a number of good speakers, and we'll have some Manjul Bhargav uh, speaking in a couple of months from now. Uh, uh, Alan Turing lectures are in both biology and computer science, engineering, and related areas. We finished a set of lectures by Bill Bialek on neurosciences uh, recently. Uh, so in, in this. The sort of the schema of these lectures is that you have the first lecture as a sort of a general, aimed at a general scientific audience, 
and the remaining two or three uh, are aimed at specialists. There are other sort of lectures we have, like the Abdus Salam lecture, ICTS Distinguished Lectures, and ICTS Public Lectures, but uh, uh, this is sort of a very important part of our... Uh, 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 so typically there's a discussion meeting surrounding uh, each of these lecture series, so as to make it a sort of a full-fledged activity. So um, this is what the campus will eventually look like. Uh, so just to give you a glimpse so that next time you come, hopefully we'll, we'll be closer to this. But I hope you can sort of see the glimmerings of this, that uh, we are on our way. Uh, but uh, I apologize for all the glitches and other things that uh, will inevitably be there. And uh, 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 so do have patience and uh, 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 come back again, uh, especially if you have, and I am sure you will, a very stimulating workshop. So all the best, and uh, see you around.